I will sing you pirate songs and tell you pirate stories. Of、oh, when dear when she'd had her fill of Peter Pan and the other lost boys. Now Wendy never was a girl to go against her friends, but recall when Hook had kidnapped her and promised no good end, surrounded then by pirates and asked to join the crew. The story goes she told them no. But not all tales are true. Wouldn't she rather climb the rigging and wield a cutlass bright? Wouldn't she rather have her own sweet sail, wrong and right? Your decision, girl, says Hook. You think you'll pass the test? The scurvy crew are sniggering, but Wendy answers yes. You set me any task, old man, and watch me see it through. You've never known the likes of piracy a girl can do. Old Hook Mew sets me to draw a contract then and there. Survive and you're my daughter, says he. Succeed and you're my heir, says Wendy. Then I'll sign, but Captain, just be sure you know. Break your word and it's straight to retirement or down to the crock you go. Says Hook, you see you do the same, my girl. No secret plans. If ever I find you're scheming with that rascal Peter Pan, it's down to the crock you'll go yourself for a likewise watery grave. But Wendy simply shakes his hand, resolving to be brave. Says Captain Hook, I keep my word. Says Wendy, we shall see. She signs the scroll, red-handed jail, and hands it back to Smee. She sets her jaw and binds her hair. A girl, no longer free. Well, old Hook thought he had Wendy, and he thought he'd break her yet. He set her first to scrubbing pots and swabbing every deck. Before you learn the pirate life, you'll do the work that's worst. We'll not have you soft, Jill. You'll know hunger, work, and thirst. So it's up the deck and down the deck, red-handed Jill did toil. For Hook would never have a future daughter known as spoiled. She cooks, she cleans, grows strong and lean, and every night she cries. For all Hook's men keep up their jeers, the harder that she tries. Well, it didn't take long as we knew to be for Peter Pan to learn of Wendy's state, and he strove to knock old Hook a nasty turn. He comes to rescue Wendy, steals out to the ship by night, and dries her tears most gallantly in the full moon's yellow light. Let's go back to the forest, says brave Peter with a smile. Your brothers truly miss you as the lost boys do, and I. He longs to take his hand, but she must shake her head. The tears return. She takes a breath to say what must be said. I'm bound to stay here, Peter, and to learn among Hook's men until such time as they decide to call me one of them. Oh, Peter Pan! He smacks his head to clear his silly ears. He can't believe what Wendy says. Not a word of what he hears. But Wendy Peter says this ship is not where you belong. Wendy cries, this ship is mine, and Peter Pan is wrong. Like you, I'll use my cunning and survive to see the dawn. And when this scurvy crew is in hand, I'll set a course for home. She winks at Peter, then in hopes he'll understand her game. But Peter flies just out of reach and quickly places blame. Says Pan, you have betrayed me. Hook has stolen you away, and so I wish you joy of him until your dying day. Says Wendy, very well, Pan, though I'll never wish you ill. Just see you steer clear of your enemy, red-handed Jill. And Peter flies away, a furious star against the black. And Wendy squares her shoulders, though she feels her young heart. Oh, I will sing you pirate songs and tell you pirate stories of Wendy when she'd had a fill of Pan and the other lost boys of red-handed Jill who'd had her fill of Pan and his lost boys.